All right, we are here with Robert Scoble in Half Moon Bay. Yay! And I just wanted to do a quick follow-up little video with Robert. Uh, I uh, just noticed he had changed his wallpaper to a couple of pictures that we did last night, including one of him and his wife. Yeah, that was done by you! Yeah! <laughs> Great photo, by the way. Everybody's been uh, liking it on Facebook and plus learning it on Google+. Plus. So. Awesome. Yeah. Well... Yesterday, you did a little interview, or it was one of the times you were talking to me, and you asked me a question. Yeah. You asked uh, how I get people to, I don't know, what was it, like, be relaxed, or well, you how you... get people how you know, do looking it. happy <laughs> in your photos. <laughs> and then your wife walked down to the beach and said hi for... She was just there a couple of minutes. Yeah. And I went, ran and got my... 85 millimeter and i was like well here let's do this so i think we shot for what was it two minutes something like that really really short amount of time okay so now the question is back on you how is it that i do it well, or what you, do you think that it is that i do you said you uh, do this cute little laugh behind the camera to get people to look at <laughs> different places um well one you know i talked about this right to get a photo made of you that looks cool, one, you have to give Scott some time to find a, a, a good location. Yeah, when, I mean, I guess it was... Light, you have to be there when the light is rocking. Yeah. Right? And then you got to work with him a little bit and show off a little bit or have some playfulness. And that, yeah. that takes some time to get comfortable. And most people... One, I'm, I'm pretty comfortable in front of the camera because I do it all, all day long. Uh, so yes. I, I can do that pretty quickly. A lot of people can't. So normal people, you know, you got to give Scott an hour or two to work with you to <laughs> get you, you know, get you over your uh, insecurities of being in front of a lens and having somebody shoot you, right? Yeah. So while we say it was, you know, two minutes of shooting, I was there for probably a half an hour getting a feel for the location and taking some pictures there. Yeah. And I had known you for what, like, we met last year around the sixth time. Yeah, we met up in Yosemite and shot stars together and uh -huh. stuff like that. So. And I think a lot of it for uh, people that I talk to, they just kind of have this kind of trust and confidence. Yeah, and you have a playful attitude and a good personality that I, I can see puts people at ease. They don't feel threatened by you. Okay. You know, they don't think you're going to do gotcha, you know, find a, a, an image that's going to make them look bad, right? Uh-huh. Um, and a lot of, a lot, some journalists do that. They they make you feel like, oh, this guy might, you know, be looking for something other than what, I'm, what I want to be portrayed as, right? And I don't feel that with you. Yeah. So it was harder for me to describe, so I wanted to get a, a feedback from someone else that was on the other side of the camera. Yeah. It's, uh, yeah. You know, I think that comes down to it. You get comfortable, and then when you get comfortable, you start goofing off and, you know, trying different things. It's when you're not comfortable that you, you start doing the the stiff, you know, kind of thing, and you want to get out of the situation. Um, you know, if you're having fun, it's uh, you get nice images. I mean, this is not even close to the best ones you've done. <laughs> I mean, you have people who are... Holding violins on their heads in the middle of a field, <laughs> yeah, uh, with with a forest fire going on behind them. I mean, uh, you know, really good but stuff. This but this is pretty much the two of you. Yeah, this describes you pretty well. Yeah, yeah so. it came out nice. It's beautiful. Well, good. Thank Thanks you so for much. giving your input. Yeah. Have a good day.